Good day YouTube. Today I'm doing just a bit of a quick fun comparison video between Linux Mint 21 on the left hand side here versus Linux Lite on the right hand side here. So they're both based off Ubuntu, long term service release. They're both running on the XFCE desktop environments. But they, they're they not actually the same uh, really the way that they've decided to put the look and feel. So let's open up the applications menu for Linux Mint and we can see we've got our categorization of apps. We can type in for whatever we want there. But on the right hand side it will be still somewhat similar for Linux Lite but it is a a little bit more beautiful, a little bit more refined in my opinion there. Uh, it's a little bit less stock uh, that the Linux Mint variety of the XFC desktop environment uh, chooses to employ. Uh, moving on, uh, if we were to go to say the, oh and my, my mouse power has died, there we go, switch into the, uh, the, the trackpad. But we've got a few extra options, uh, something that's called Linux Lite, Lite in the name. Got a few more options and a bit of uh, beautifully colorized uh, icon iconography sets there as well. But I just like to open up the terminal and do my nasty nasty as needed. Next up, uh, we'll go to the file manager and uh, see now I'm, I'm really digging the, the color icons, the, the color accents and tones that Linux Lite chooses to employ as well. Just a really refined in comparison to uh, Linux Mint. They are actually, or they should be, and correct me if I'm wrong in just a moment, yeah, they are running on the exact same version of Thuna. So uh, yeah, it just looks a bit different the way that they've customized them there, but hey, right click, open terminal, keeps me happy. Uh, next up, let's have a little bit of a look under the hood, see what's going on there. So uh, as I mentioned before, they're both running on the same backend, Ubuntu long-term service release, so they do have the same kernel. A fairly recent kernel, not the latest and greatest, but fairly recent there. And last but not least, let's have a little bit of a look at the RAM usage on boot up. Now take these values with a bit of a grain of salt, but uh, we are running at 595 megabytes of RAM on boot up for Linux Mint. Whereas Linux Lite, not so light, especially with a name like that. If you're going to put light in the title of your operating system, you don't want to be any more than three, four, five hundred megabytes of RAM. Certainly not more than Linux Mint XFCE edition. So let's see, 616 megabytes of RAM on boot up. So a bit of a shame there. Uh, it doesn't live up to the name, unfortunately. It's not a great deal more, but I, j I just really feel like it should be a couple of hundred megabytes less. But that's, uh, otherwise, it is quite a beautiful operating system. So that's pretty much it guys, thanks for watching. Please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button, and I do hope to see all of you guys there in the next one. Cheers.